Hello everybody. I haven't recorded a video for a little bit and ignore my little halfway like big dipper on my forehead. Hormones are going crazy right now. But anyways, um yeah, uh yesterday I got that done. Uh, I got this one done when I was like 20, I would say. Uh, so I didn't really remember like how it felt or anything like that. Um, I actually got it done for free. Well, I had to pay for the jewelry, so I only paid ten dollars. It was a inner thread one where they just have to like bend the um, ball part, like the post behind it, like bend it a little bit, and they put the jewelry in through the back, of course, and pop that in and keep it there. Um, but it was too short for my luscious lips, I guess. I'll um, put in a couple pictures of what it was looking like with that jewelry in. Uh, it was also an 18 um, gauge, I don't know, millimeter, whatever they use. Um, fuck it's loud. Sorry. It's yelling at me again, telling me that I need to create more space. Because every single time I plug the fucker into my computer, it decides to put everything that's on my computer on my phone again. So I have like triples, quadruples of the same shit. So it's kind of retarded. But, um, yeah. Uh, so I had to go back in later that night. Um, I, well, I sent him a picture. Well, two pictures. So I showed him like the inside of my lip of the thing like sucking in my lip. And then I showed him the one on the outside. And those are actually the pictures I'm going to show you guys. Um, but I was like, so uh, how tight is too tight? And then he called me like right away. And he's like, too tight. I was like, okay. So when can we fix it? And he's like, can you come in tonight or tomorrow? And I was like, uh. And my uh, roomie like was just walking by. And she, I was like, can we go in tonight and um get my thing changed because it's too small and it was really hurting i don't know if you've ever felt something being too tight or uh maybe the backing being too small on the on one of these this one kind of does it you can tell it, like sucks in like that kind of but since i'm so old i just pop it back and it's fine which is from it pushing against my teeth but it was really bad and it was really sharp around the backing of it. Um, the one that I have in right now, it's a lot thicker and uh, more smoothed off. Um, and anyways, so I went there. Um, he came out like right away and he's like, come on back. And then he was like, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry you didn't come back and all this stuff. I'm like, don't worry about it. Um, and he was like, well, I have one more. Okay, so I made more space on my phone. Uh, and hopefully it won't get chopped again. So I'll try to be quick now. Well, he said that he had one more of the same type of jewelry that was a little bit longer. Uh, he took it out of the case and then it fell on the ground. And then he just kind of stood there staring at Skylar and I for a little bit because he was so fucking pissed off because he's doing a trial and error thing. Wanted to see how that worked with my lip, um, how it healed with it, and if it would have came off or anything like that through eating or sleeping uh so then he had to go to the back and he got a normal one and he got it a 16 gauge instead of 18 so it would match this one um this one i got done i think with the 14 but i can fit a 16 in it which is smaller and it won't like pull through or anything like that um so that was fun i had to get a needle put back through again through a fresh hole in my lip it started bleeding of course because well first it was already pierced and then also I took three ibuprofen to try to make the swelling go down because I thought that would make it not suck in my face like it was doing so yeah um it bled for just a little bit it wasn't that bad but uh I can tell much more room much much happier with it and that looks like I have a diamond. No. Nah. It's kind of swollen now. Yeah, you can tell. Kind of looks like it got punched in the mouth. Uh, 
before though it wasn't like that bad like it really wasn't that swollen uh i love it like i like going there because uh they don't use clamps a lot uh they freehand for piercings a lot and uh usually you would hear people you know like the clamps are like the worst part like they're really uncomfortable and all that well they add a lot more trauma like if you're gonna swell you're gonna swell a lot worse with the clamps to be honest um this one it looked like this one like right after pretty much like as soon as i got home uh because this one was done with a clamp um and it's really uncomfortable really because they have to like pull it down you know like that and just no even this one was free-handed and it was done by the same guy so yeah i don't even think i've done a video on that one yet either so i'll probably have to do that but yeah um i'm gonna get another like two piercings on my face i've decided that i want my second nose piercing over there so that's kind of cool um i'd be like i don't know box thing i don't know it's better than jay my piercer saying that it looks like a dick on my face because i want to get the medusa done right here you know which it'll be like right in that little you know the curve in your lips and some people have which actually i heard that girls that have it have a higher sex drive and when guys have like the butt chin they have a higher sex drive but i don't know how that really pertains it actually works it's true. i know myself but you know, i don't remember where i heard it from either so <laughs> but yeah um the only like complaint i have with my lip piercing is when i smile or laugh it catches like right that like I'm doing already it's really annoying because mm, that's like the worst pain ever is like ow, like bumping it up or down or anything like that like that stretches the hole yeah it's pretty much like when I got it done again yesterday um I could seriously like I felt like I could feel it stretching it was really weird like it wouldn't didn't want to slide on the post even though he lubed it up like after I left like when I was coming home like I was like dude it's like it feels like it's stuck like it's really tight on it it's really weird yeah alrighty everybody well um when I was going through my or the videos I uh found like some hiking videos and all that so I'm sure that's on my computer so I'm gonna have some like come hike with me videos and possibly like next spring i'll do more and it will motivate me more because i want to lose all my weight anyways that i gained with my dad getting sick and having his strokes a couple years ago because <sighs> like i used to be well i used to be like a size three after i lost like 50 pounds from hiking and then I got put on some medication and it made me gain weight. Yep. Which I'll probably make that into a different video. But anyways, yep. Uh, happy piercing, everybody. If you have any questions, you know, comment or message me. And I'm going to be making more videos about my piercings and the pain and all that. So like and subscribe if you want to follow up on everything else that you might see all this metal and I have like my industrial done and all that too which I pretty much remember that I think pretty much anybody that's gotten that done will remember that so yeah uh, I'm gonna put more stuff on my planet on my face make sure it goes away I get really distracted all right seriously now bye happy piercing. <laughs>